Welcome to Outback Outdoors. Make sure you like, subscribe, and click the alert to stay up to date on all our new videos. Here we got Killer One. We'll call Happy Killer One, Catherine Killer Two. Yeah. Oh, yeah. How, how many years did this tag take you? 18? 21. 21. 21. You could have pretty much drawn almost any unit in the state. Yes. Yeah. And you chose to believe us. Yes. And <laughs> come on this silly adventure. <laughs> Fourth <laughs> rifle. What's the date? It's almost December. It's November 24th. 24th. Oh, Tomorrow yeah. is Thanksgiving. Yes. Gobble, gobble, snort, snort. And Glenn, Happy, and Catherine, Glass are here for an adventure in the high country Colorado mule deer. Up ahead, we have the whippersnapper crew. That's Tanner and <laughs> Clay. They're kind of our spotters right now. We've got Catherine's the Sherpa. Thank you, Catherine. Yeah. yeah. Tanner and Clay. AKA Elk Slayer. Elk Slayer, yeah. She has a bull elk tag. Yep. Are you excited? Uh, yeah. First uh, bull elk. So. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> you said you've been up since what, 3 30, Catherine? Yeah, sadly. <laughs> what gives me? What's our plan? <laughs> well, we're going to go up here and we're going to find. Hmm. I don't know if it'll be 200, 195 probably. Okay. All right, we're the first ones in here. If you'll notice, this blanket of snow is unfettered. We are making tracks. Let's go make tracks. Okay. All right, we're gonna go find a 195, he said. Okay, great. That was great. I'm good, no, really, seriously. I'm good. <laughs> I'm good. I think it's a good day to be hunting bucks. So, what's the plan here? The plan is to glass as much of this sage country where we've been seeing lots of bucks as we can and find the one, the one true buck. The giant. We know they're around. strip tanner up there there's that kind of that pokey bush so when you see the upper strip this so there's this barn right now with the snow and then there's that sagebrush part yep. and then that up top of it the ridge kind of there's kind of that little strip open yep. between the trees yep. right in the middle of that there's a buck running a bill around He's yep. just making his way any way he can. Because that's just a little bit more. How's he look? What? Uh, I can't. I could see a pretty decent frame, it looked like. I'll go grab your spot real quick. I can get it. He's already gone. Yeah, he's got clay There was a. There was a buck. About 60 yards right here when I walked over. Little guy? And he would have been really nice if he was a coos deer. <laughs> 95 incher. Four point though. Good backs, pretty much no fronts. He's not, he's pretty narrow.
don't, don't, don't. watching us. <laughs> what do you think? I can't see him. She, he's going to put mean, the spotter on. I can't tell, but he's sitting there watching us. Okay. Did you get him in the scope gun? ears. Yeah, it's beautiful. Glenn, did you find him in here?
you do on the first day when you find such a awesome bite? He's, he's good everywhere. He's not the whitest, but he's outside his ears. He's good deep forge, yeah. good mass. Like he's just a beautiful, typical forge. Yeah, awesome. Okay, did you have him? No, I've never had him. Okay, then let me put it on him again. Then. I didn't do anything, it's just dipping. All you can see is his white face out there. Wow, okay. He's looking right at you. He's laying down. First of all, you see is his white face. He's laying down there. Oh, okay, thank you. Gorgeous. He's, I think you need to. I think we probably ought to try to. Because we just, if we've not seen anything else like this. And so oh, you're hard. Right here. Just, what? You're right here. And, okay, so it's, it's, it's all. Let's bring it in. Let's bring it in. If you, like, if, you're, if it makes you happy. Because we cannot. And literally, after this snow, we might drive up Belly Egg tonight. There might be a 200 inch deer, but there might not. It's so, it's so hard. Shoot him. I don't think you're gonna disappoint anybody. If you pass him, you're not gonna disappoint anybody. Yeah. It's kind of what you think. And we still have Catherine's out tag. Yeah. So I guess the question is, Abby, what do you want from this hunt? Do you want the experience? Do you want the memories? I, I'm sure you do. But where does that weigh in with the size of the deer you want to kill? Yeah. I've got a lot of nice animals on the first day. <laughs> I have a 365 elk at home on the first day. Yeah, a lot of that has to do with your guide too. You have a heck of a guide. <laughs> yeah, my elk's on the outside of the garage. <laughs> well, 
hey, one thing's for sure, we're not going to shoot embedded. So it would have to be something where you'd have to move into a position where you could then, you know, you could get comfortable. It'd have to be completely 100% comfortable. Yeah. Uh -huh. What's our distance? 350. 350. Thanks for watching Outback Outdoors. We encourage you to comment below and as always, like, subscribe, and click the alert to stay up to date on all our new videos.